thank you for joining this quick troubleshooting screencast brought to you by Salesforce Support. To see more content like this, hit subscribe. In this video, we'll learn how to configure heat map settings for a Salesforce Maps marker layer. Heat maps allow users to visualize the intensity of data to help better understand concentration of markers for key quantitative values in Salesforce Maps. Open the Salesforce Maps Marker Layer Editor by creating a new marker layer or editing an existing one and select the Heat Map Options tab. Choose the Radius of Influence for each data point measured in pixels and an opacity setting for your heat map. If you want your heat map to reflect the density of the number of markers in a geographic area, Salesforce Maps recommends using the default radius and opacity values of 15 pixels and 80% respectively. If you want your heat map to reflect the density of a quantitative value for the markers in the marker layer, select a number field from the options available in the Weighted Value drop-down menu and change the max intensity setting to 90% of the highest value of the weighted value field. For example, if the highest value in your weighted value field is 10,000, enter 9,000 for the max intensity. Click Save and Plot to save your changes and plot this marker layer on the map. To display the heat map, hover over the Query Display icon for this marker layer and change the display mode to Render Heat Map. For more information, check out help.salesforce.com or join us on the trail at trailblazer.salesforce.com.